Hi friends, what's up? This is RK from 360 Reader. Right now, I'm going to show how to stop sharing calendars on iPhone and iPad. Did you change your mind on a calendar that you are currently sharing using your iPhone or iPad? Perhaps you want to remove one or more people who have access to your shared calendar. It's pretty easy to stop sharing a calendar within the calendar app of iOS and iPadOS. Sharing your calendars from your iPhone and iPad is one thing, but managing your shared calendars is a completely different task. A shared calendar can be edited by other users if they have the necessary permissions, meaning they can add or remove events from the calendar. Therefore, it's important to keep your shared list updated to make sure only the people you authorize can continue to make changes to the calendar you are sharing. That all being said, let's learn how to stop sharing calendars on iOS or iPadOS. Before getting started, make sure you have subscribed our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any update from 360 Reader. It's worth pointing out that the steps are same for both iOS and iPadOS. In this guide, I'm going to show the steps only for iOS, but the same steps can apply to iPadOS as well. To get started, launch the calendar app on your iPhone or iPad. After that, you have to tap on the calendars tab located at the bottom center, and then you have to tap on the information means i button located right next to the calendar that you are currently sharing. Next up, you should see the names of all the persons you have shared your calendar with under Shared with section. Now tap on the person with whom you no longer want to share your calendar with and then you have to tap on Stop Sharing. Now a pop-up will appear from the bottom of the screen. Tap Remove in the pop-up to confirm the action. That's pretty much it. So that's the way you can stop sharing your calendar with anyone on your iPhone or iPad. Now that you know how it works, Make the most of free to manage your shared calendar on your iOS or iPad OS device. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like and share it, and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye bye.